How to send announcements to your ticket buyers using email broadcasts. Open the relevant event and select Email Broadcasts from the left-hand navigation. Fill in the subject and message with the content you'd like to send to your ticket buyers, holders of a specific ticket type, or waitlist sign-ups. Use the recipients drop-down to choose your audience. If you're using our recurring events feature, you'll need to select the desired date or time slot for your message. You can format the message to look however you want using the tools provided, and you can add placeholders to personalise the message. For example, if you wanted a personalised greeting, such as Hi Sarah Brown, click the Insert Placeholder button and click Ticket Buyer Name. This will add a placeholder to the message that will be replaced by the ticket buyer's name. You can also use placeholders to resend ticket vouchers or an online event link to all of your ticket buyers for convenience. To add them to the message, click on the Insert Placeholder button and select Ticket Vouchers. Next, we recommend that you check that it looks good in the inbox by sending a test email. Read and tick to agree to the terms and send a test by entering your email address in the Send Test Email section and clicking on the Send Test Email button. It should only take a moment to arrive in your inbox, so check how it looks and make any necessary changes. If you're not ready to send yet, click Save Draft. You can come back and send it later. When you're ready to send, click the Send Broadcast button. You'll get a quick preview to check it over one final time. Click the Send to X Recipients button. Finally, select when you want your email to be sent. Your options are immediately. Send your message instantly to your chosen audience. If you are using recurring events, you can only immediately send an email broadcast to individual occurrences. At a scheduled date and time, choose a specified time to send your message. At a scheduled interval before the event starts, Choose to send your message a certain number of hours or days before your event. At a scheduled interval after the event ends, choose to send your message a certain number of hours or days after your event. Your email broadcast is now queued for sending and the system will take care of the rest.